so hello friends welcome back to my youtube channel and today i am going to show you how you can make your own magnifying glass in koto so first of all what you need to do is you need to go here and you can see this is the canvas layer that i have made so in this canvas layer i have made the magnifying glass so let me show you how you can make it too okay so let me hide this one and let me go here and add a canvas layer node and once you have done that you need to go here and add a control node and make sure this control node fix perfectly on the screen then you need to go here and add a texture rectangle node and uh, this will help us clipping the circle from the rectangular sub report node later okay so we can just set it up later now let's next we need to go for a sub viewport container node and then we need to go for sub viewport node and then we need to go for camera 2d node so you need to add all these nodes here after that you can see this is the viewport so you need to go on sub viewport container node and click on this and then you need to go here on layout you can change the size here so i want to set it up by 512 by 512 and then you need to go on your rectangle texture rect size so first of all you need to set all these things up into the center of the screen so everything will line up so you can see it's now in the center and if i want to set it up you can just set it up or drag it and make it center of the screen okay so after setting up uh, at the center of the screen what you need to do is you need to go on your texture rect and add a masking layer so we will just mask it so let me do the mask later we will first create the magnifying glass work cable so let's add a script to it so i already created a script for it so let's add that script so you can see this is the magnifying glass that basically is nothing but a camera that moves and follow the map so we will just using this to make the map move up and right down left and then you can see i have a camera 2d node which is this one so this camera 2d node and what we are going to do we need to change the position of this magnifying glass with camera 2d which is here you can see it so this is our player so and uh, when the player moves the camera 2d also moves the player is our magnifying glass right and what this one this line does this is basically to get the word 2d behind the sub report node and it will get the word 2d node and then we can just uh, use that right so let's get started and let's see how it works how it looks in the execution scene so let's execute it and see how it looks so you can see it's now looking like a magnifying glass but uh, not perfectly we need to make it make sure the zoom is perfect so i'm going to set the zoom to 2 and once you have set the zoom to 2 you can see the magnifying glass will uh, zoom the full map or the screen that the camera 2d node of the player is seeing by 2 right and you can see i have done a very um, reverse thing here the side part is actually the magnifying glass and thus this one is uh, mini map i don't want to do this so we will just do the half of this we will just set up the mini map to by 0.5 so after setting it you will see that um, you can see now the magnifying glass is zooming on the map right after that you need to set the texture rectangle here which is basically i want this uh, magnifying glass in circle so for that we will need to go on the texture rect add this mask.png after doing this you need to go here and set this to clip plus draw or maybe you can also set up clip only and uh, once you have done that you can increase the size as you want depending on your case so i'm just um i just want want it like this so yeah 
and after this what we what i will do i will just add a border here so for that i am just going to add a sprite to denote and uh, i have already made a border png so we can just use that so this is the border png and i just want to make it fill the magnifying glass right so we can just do that and so after doing this our magnifying glass will work as it should be so let's see how it looks okay so you can see now our magnifying glass is working fine and it looks very amazing thanks for watching if you want to see more videos in the future and that will help you a lot so you can just subscribe to the channel thanks a lot